Part of the parent partnership remit is to work with schools in terms of um, training and development and the course that you know we're running this morning, Confident Schools, Confident Parents, is predominantly around enabling schools to see a parent's view, to see you know what perhaps their communication is missing. So what I'd like you to look for is, ex is you know examples of good practice, areas of good practice in school in communicating and also room for improvement, areas for improvement. So we're going to start, I think, with Teresa. We've just showed um, a group of school staff, head teachers, Senkos, three video clips of parents whose children are on School Action or School Action Plus. And it was to show schools what parents really feel about their communication with their child's school. We've called our programme, our training programme, Confident um, Schools, Confident Parents. And it's really trying to increase um, the, the, the positive communication between home and school because what we felt at the beginning of the project was you know if schools were confident in what they could offer to parents and to, to children at School Action and School Action Plus the children's parents would be confident in the schools and alongside of this three-day training we're also providing a, a substantial pack of resources for schools um, to enable them to communicate better and more effectively with parents, particularly around children on School Action and School Action Plus. The pack that we've produced includes things like a directory of services because we realise that um, schools don't have time to look around for community services for parents and increasingly parents come to them with issues of you know things like you know domestic violence or looking for a parent support group of some kind or you know wanting help with filling in a DLA form and schools just simply don't have the time to, to either help the parents with those issues or to signpost them to the right services so we thought that we'd give schools as much support as we could to then support parents.